There's a thing there. <laughs> the amazing thing is, I might have to stay up here. <laughs> this foot here, a little bit wet. <laughs> wow! Yeah. In that grass, it's a little, little stump.
are in the house. Another live show. show. You were there as everybody. Boom! Welcome to the 77th show, which is quite a few. It's one more than 76, which is not bad, really. Okay, now, just going to drink from the old gift of a mug. Mmm. Welcome, people. All wheel riders and those who haven't yet purchased from speedyfeet.co.uk, which is where you need to go, obviously, because why would you go anywhere else? That would just be crazy. Let me just go into the old fast books, see if I can, oh, it's working. Probably gonna have full volume. Oh, there we are, boom. Got it. It's all right, I've sorted it out, I'm not daft. Paul Edward Binney, good afternoon, guys. I still have my KS60 next, but not riding it until I return from Austria. Snowboarding trip pending. And that's on the old Facebook. And we've got a few people, forgot my mouse. Patrick McGowan, hello from Richmond Hill, Ontario, Canada, a V10F, 2 million kilometers. Uh, Seagoat is in the house. Seagoat is in the house. He just says, hi Ian. Hi, welcome. James Mucklin, cheers Ian and Mara. Hello. Uh, loving my Z10 from you. Thank you very much. I'm glad you are liking it. How many miles have you done so far? If I remember your name just from your username, I think it's Craig, isn't it? I think. Uh, Gary Wright, good afternoon. Jazzigas, hello, 75 miles on my 9.1 S2 around Lanley. Lan 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 Ooh, Magic Mouse. Get it? Because those of you who know Apple products, this is actually a Magic Mouse, Magic Mouse 2. And it appeared magically. <clears throat> I'm here all week, sadly. Let's have another look. I'm gonna find out where Lelena is now. It's Wales somewhere, is it? Uh, town in Wales. Lelena is the largest town in the county of Carmarthenshire and the preserved country of Dyfed, Wales. Located on the Long Low Hoare Estuary, some 10 miles northwest of Swansea and 12 miles east southeast of the county town Carmarthen. It's famous for its rugby tradition and ha as a centre of tin plate production. There you go. You get more than you bargain for on this show. But welcome. You're not that million miles from us, really, are you, to be fair? Um, we are just on the border, almost, to Wales. Kind of. Uh, chat keeps jumping all over the place. Here we go. Richard Skull. A good afternoon. Bristol, UK. Riding. Gotway Nicola and MSX for off-road. Rich, Rob Hitch is in the house. Good afternoon, everyone. Farnborough, UK. The show's just started on my laptop. How can that be? Ah, the slide has gone a bit back, a bit far. Um, so Rob Hitch has got a V8. He's got approximately 800 miles on it. And he's done about 450 miles on his Nikola Plus. And he can't even remember the figures. That guy with 2 million miles, kilometers, can remember. Hello from Germany, EUC Roadrunner, with a KS60 next. He's done 2,552 kilometers. James Mucklin just got a new 1860 watt hour 100 volt MSX. He's done 90 miles, Pennsylvania, US of A. Craig Goatley, correct. Seagoat is Craig Goatley with his Z10. New rider in the house. That's what I'd like to see. Brand new riders getting on it. He got the Z10 from us a week ago, two weeks ago, something like that, I think, from memory. Memory's not that great, look. Uh, Jim in Damascus. Wow, Damascus. Um, 16x, 156 miles. Welcome, James. Marcus, Sweden. Hello, Gottenberg in the house. Gotway Tesla, of course. Gary Wright has popped his inner tube on his KS18XL. We could do with inner tubes, couldn't we? Yeah. Mm. Gary wrote in, wanted inner tubes. Haven't got an answer yet. They said, we'll let you know tomorrow. Saves me replying to emails, doesn't it? Should just do everything. Well, no, do no emails at all. No, should have emails coming in, but no, they're guaranteed not to be replied to, apart from the live show, to make everyone tune in. It'd be quite a busy live show that would be. Yeah, 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 yeah brilliant, wouldn't it? Let's get everyone crowding in. They'd have to wait a week as well for the answer, so it's probably not that efficient. Anyway, um, uh, try some um, tire weld. Try some Holtz tire weld. You can get it from Holford's, or you can get it from us, but you need to pay FedEx if you get it from us. So you're probably cheaper to go to Holford's, your local Holford's. 
Punch repair kit. Yeah. I got a time lapse of Mario using the Holtz tire. Well, I don't know. Mm. You're using it. Yeah. Lot of, uh, yeah. Some of it went in the inner tube, didn't it? Yeah, a little bit. And some of it went elsewhere. It looks as though he covered the wheel in shaving foam. <laughs> That's what it looked like from the outside. He knew what he's doing apparently, though. So. Uh, yeah, uh, done 50 miles, Craig has, on his Z10. Well done. Good one, Craig. That was good. Dave Wood is in the house. Uh, I missed last week's live. Not this week, sir. You're here. We were all waiting for you last week, and you never turned up. Northeast UK, V10, just short of 500 miles. Caesar Raymond, good morning. It's 10.34 a.m., wherever he is. So I wonder which parts of the world. Can we work out from that where he is? Anyone know? Let's find out. Where is it 10.38? Uh, why is that not working? There we are. Where is it 10.38 now? The worldwide clock. Hmm. Detective work. I wonder where he could possibly be. So, New York, it's 11.38. Oh, hello. I could probably, most popular, sort by, uh, mm, not sure. Ah, oh, it's in alphabetical order. How can you not? Time, here we go. Here we go. Time. Edit cookies, okay. I'll, I'll accept all your marketing tracking cookies. 10.38, so we've got, hmm. Mexico City, Chicago, New Orleans, Dallas, Houston, Ottawa, Toronto. No, oh, that's it. Oh, hello. So he's in one of those places. Excellent. Gone off track a little bit. Um, ben Sims, good morning for me anyway. MSX with something like 500 miles in it. Ben Sims, welcome to the show. Good to see you. Uh, he's from Houston, Texas. Caesar Raymond was. So we're the right sort of area. Mm -hmm. uh, that was good. Uh, Elder Aaron Mortison from Oslo. He's done three and a half thousand kilometers on his KS18L. And he's done that in nine months. Oh. How much is that per month? A lot. Brilliant. Hey Siri. 3,500 divided by nine. 3,500 divided by nine is about 388.8. 388 kilometers a month. Hey Siri. 388 kilometers in mile. 388 kilometers is 241.09 miles. It guess what I was going to say. It's 241 miles a month. How much is that a week? Do right. for. Yeah, do that. Uh, Claudio AGM Filo. Hi there from Rex Recife in Brazil, South America. Welcome to the show. And you are on Facebook. Welcome. Ian Robertson, hello. Ian Robertson is watching this live show. We are sat in the HQ, the hustle and bustle of Speedy Feet. Kind of. Um, he's in the same town. He's in Mitchell Dean also, in the small, sleepy, rural town of Mitchell Dean. When someone once wrote on an envelope, Mitchell's Beans. When I used to work at Xerox, they sent it in, it said Mitchell's Beans. Never forgotten that. Uh, hi Ian, how you doing? Great name by the way. Uh, Spout the right way uh, is a pretty much the best name. We worked out last week that Ian was probably the best name that you could have. By popular vote, wouldn't it? Mm, don't remember that. You can't remember that? No. Mm, not paying attention, shame. Gary Wright, Dave Wood, get in touch on Facebook. There you go, there's a shout out for you. Norbert J, long time follower. Hello from Poland, in motion V5F plus and a V10F. Welcome to the show. A lot of people on today, isn't there? Dalmeek K, Dalmeek C. Afternoon, Ian. Afternoon. Uh, we've got an MCM five in Romania, and that's Omidel. Uh, any news about Iron Career or new Emotion Wheel? No, nope, no news whatsoever. I did watch the video you pointed me to the last time. I mean, it was a bit meh, bit meh, whatever. Uh, I wasn't that taken by it really. Uh, it's just a just the rock wheel. 
And afternoon, speedy people. 400k, 18xl in South London. Now, I say South London because that's how he's written it. Um, hi all from Italy. My 16x gets 1600 kilometers already. Still works well. That's Davastato EUC. Um, Gary Wright, he lives in Newcastle. A few of us meet for a ride. We will get one sorted. Now, as the weather improves, hmm. we've had two storms in a row and lots of flooding. If you haven't seen the news, it's a TV screen there with myself on it. That's new, isn't it? Mm, the contrast is a bit old, isn't it? You notice that? It's just because it's a really old monitor. Yeah. Which to which? The contrast out or it's a really old monitor? Both. Both. Yeah, it's, it's, that's, been, that's been in this business a long time. It's, small, so. it's seen some action, that, that monitor. Um, anyway, uh, where was I? Hello all, KS18L. KS that's Michael King. Michael King is back in the house. Long time follower of this show. Uh, he is from the United States of America. Uh, EUC Adventures Afternoon MSX Rich KS18L is Jax. Is Jax still riding? I think I asked that last week. Not sure I got an answer to that question because she had a bit of a spill, didn't she? I seem to remember last time. And then she came out on the Bristol ride. Is that right? She had a spill. And then she came out on the Bristol ride and it wasn't that enjoyable for her, to be fair. Um, I'd like to know if she's back up and going again. Espen Rise is on an 18x, there's a lot of King songs in the house, 18xl, and he is from Sweden, pronounced correctly, because I'd like to get the, if I can get the dialect up. Uh, Dalmik C has got an MCM5, he's Swan Scum, 327 miles, wheel has 445 miles, so I go from that, that you got it used, is what I would say. Uh, hi from Canada. How do you say, how do you, how do you talk in Canadian accent? Canada? I'm the Can wrong person, You're the wrong person? Yeah. Uh, I, well, I, I know, I just won't do an accent, I'll just say Canada. That saves the whole, it's, it's live isn't it, so it's too late now, I can't go back. And, uh, King Song 16S, a 16X, an 18XL, and a monster 100 volt V3. Approximately $10,000 worth of equipment. Mm. Thereabouts. Uh, Jax is back on, although she's very nervous and takes things very steady. So she's back on the wheel. So she could do some words of encouragement, people. Fire them up, and then Rich can tell her, pass them on. Unless she's watching as well. And I could repeat them here and then say them out loud. So if she's not even watching, but she's listening, then I could say them. Words of encouragement for Jax, who had a fall on her wheel, but has got back on it. Uh, we've got Daniel Tordoff who says, are there any new wheels on the horizon? See, nothing new for 2020. Any thoughts on the MXP? He's calling it the MXP, that's all your fault. Because you called it the MSX Pro, didn't you? You started that up. And it's in fact the M Super Pro. MSP. MSP. Uh, no, I haven't got any thoughts on it. I've seen a few videos floating around, but we haven't got one. Um, I don't even know where we we'll get one, so who knows? No, I presume we're going to have one at one some point. I did write to them and say, can we have one, please? As in, can I spend some money with you to get one? But I haven't heard back yet. Climate change is a hoax, says, hello, kids, MSX, V10, V5, Jewelltron Ultra, and a boosted rev. He's from Fairhub. Brilliant. Welcome to the show. What have we got, Mario? What have we got? Is it, we got a competition, have we? Oh, we got someone else in. Michael's in the house. He, oh, hello. Michael, and he's now at, told me how to pronounce his name, because I've obviously been pronouncing it wrong all this time. Coughlin, spelt C-O-U-G-H-L-A-N. Coughlin. Coughlin. Michael Coughlin. Brilliant. He's from a place in Canada, of which you're also going to need to be able to pronounce properly, called Mississauga. Mississauga? Mississauga. Don't know. Probably. Pronouncing it wrong. Uh, V10F, and he's on 5,000 kilometres on it. Get it! Exclamation says, why you skip my message? Let me scroll back up. Mm, can't see a message. Hey. Can't even see a message. Let's have a look. Scrolling down. No, can't see it. Uh, can I control F it? 
I'm gonna cry because of you. <laughs> you can cry. It's good for you. Let it out, let it out. Just make sure you got a tissue. Uh, get something. No, get, what was the screen name? Get it, that's it. Let's try and find your, I haven't got messages from you. I've only got those two, it says, uh, no, I got nothing there. There's no messages there. Um, yeah, I love the large pedals I got from your shop. That was Elder Aaron Mortensen. Good. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Um, Afiz is in the house. And who else have we got? Um, no, I haven't missed anyone. Good. So we have got... Oh, hold on. Because i got a piece of paper here, allegedly. With some ramblings on it. Um... We got this is this is just this is what this for what's this for? The script for the, the show. Oh the whole show. Oh the news and some of the news and some of the videos. Okie dokie. News and videos section. It's not news yet. So yeah. So viewers videos. Did you get the one I sent you today and put it in the show? Please tell me you did, because you know earlier this morning I first came in at nine o'clock, mm -hmm. I said I've got a video, I sent it across to you. That one. Yeah, the uh, motor vehicle. The what? Sound, motor sound. No. No. Is it, is it for the competition? Yep. Yep. Yeah, it's in there. Is it? Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. It's like Will and yeah. local lad. Yeah. yeah. Oh, phone's ringing. Just got to let them know we're live show. So. Shame. Hello. Oh, yeah. Hello. Just in a live show at the moment, so I'm going to have to go. Yeah. Oh, All right. All right. Am I live? Yeah, you're live. I'll see you later. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Don't say anything crazy. Right, bye. Yeah, bye. Yeah. Uh, brilliant. There we go. Uh, right, so should we run the... We got the competition and then we got uh, we got an overspill of viewers' videos or not? Yeah, one. One. So let's play one viewers' video. Let's do that. Let's play that now. And I can watch on TV live, so I've got no lag. That's why that's there. But then the audio can't hear the audio. Need headphones oh. to put on. Go. Viewers' videos. Not live. Now it's live. Boom. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Plus one, two, three, and then we're in. Lovely. Got it good. Uh, there you go. Nice little viewers' videos. Thank you very much for sending that in. We have got ten, I believe, to watch. Um, someone guessed uh, Rich or EUC Adventures guessed that uh, my wife would call at sixteen forty-eight. I'm not sure if he typed that while she'd rung or he guessed that she was going to ring at that time. So uh, uh, I I already queued up. Hi, Ian's wife. There we go. Brilliant stuff. Uh, let's have a look. I just want to share that I got a V10F yesterday and I love it. Excellent stuff. Congratulations on your V10F purchase. Uh, aren't we supposed to have a guess what time Amy will call? That was rich. Yeah, you're supposed to do that at the start of every show. No one's won that competition yet. Um, and some of you cheat. They wait until she rings and then says the time. Which... That's not playing ball, is it? V Robert says V10F is a great machine. Any more news on scooter legalities? Not as far as I know, unless Mario has dug deep and done some actual work. Uh, but no, doesn't appear so. Yeah. Is, it? Yeah. is it one of them, is it? Yeah. Okay, yeah, coming up later in the show is legalities around scooters. Possibly. Possibly, yeah. It's scooter related. 
it's scooter related, so it might have nothing to do with legalities. There's a little secret I'll let you into. Mario has got a great skill, it's an art form. If you've got a question on something, you can ask him a question, and he'll come up with an answer almost straight away, so convincing that you think he actually knows the answer. It's only when you go a little bit further and see if that answer's correct, do you find out that he just made it up. But he, like, like then, so for instance, have we got anything on the legality of using scooters? He goes, oh yeah, it's in that article. What you'll probably find out is I'll read it and it's got nothing to do with it at all. The legalities. Has it got anything to do with legalities? Kind of. Kind of. Yeah, I don't have much uh, faith in that. Question about Gotway Monster V300 volt is mentioned for Gotway. The motor is 2,500 watts. I compare with version 2, which is a motor of 2,000 watts. They are identical. Where does the 500 watt difference? Where does the 500 watt difference? Not 100% sure on that question. Sorry, um, so you might have to restructure that for my poor brain. Uh, loads of people say, hi, Amy. Hello. Uh, yeah, buddy from Sweden has joined in. He's got an MSX 84 volt, 600 watt hours, and he's done a thousand kilometers on it. Welcome. Um, yeah, people still waiting for the people to take over the show without me there. That'll be good, because it means I can just go to sleep in the back room. That'll be good. So they want Amy Mars, not Mars Bar notice, just Mars. Mm. Amy, Mars, and Jonathan. Didn't want Mike in it though. Oh, Mike. Poor Mike. Uh, people don't, well, Senator Perry doesn't want me in the show, but he wants a load of other people, but he hasn't mentioned you. So he, he doesn't want you in the show either, obviously. So Sorry about that. Um, I'll get some counseling for you. Uh, Bushmaster, help. Do you sell Nicola handles? Just a handle, also Nicola, ped Nicola pedal rods. We do not, sorry. Uh, possibly could get them in, I suppose, at special request. Uh, right, so why is this not, it's not letting me scroll now, so this is actually gone wrong. There we are, it's back again, it's just crashing out, that's all. Right, shall we play? This is really crashing out on my computer. The scroll's not working. No, nope, that's, that's completely broken. Shall we play the te view, the viewers with these competition? Which competition is it? 20 second. 22nd competition to win £25 store credit at speedyfeet.co.uk. If you haven't already checked it out, go to speedyfeet.co.uk and go and buy a hoodie or something, or some stickers, or, or, or a wheel. You could buy a wheel if you wanted to, if you haven't got one already. Right, far away. Viewers, videos, competition, 22. Don't vote until the end. Jot down the number you think should win, and then vote at the end. Far away. Viewers, videos. Is the future human error? Never. This is the future.
perfect. How do you transport a board two meter two meters twenty by one meter twenty? Of course you're on an electric unicycle, so you just place it on and you walk. And he if you are skilled you can ride but I don't dare this. Have a nice day. Bye bye.
Yo, there you go. That's viewers' videos. Put your votes in now for who to win, who should win. £25 store credit at speedyfeet.co.uk. Go check out the website. Go browse it. Two years warranty on all wheels. Excellent stuff. Still be here in two years' time, pushing it. Warms my heart to see the 9 volt one e Plus still pushing. Good stuff. We've already got a couple of votes, 226 and 227. I think Devastato may have voted for himself. Possibly. It's only a suspicion. Uh, do I use slime in my tyre? No, I don't. Mario does. Well, some slime, mostly air. Uh, ben Sims 227. Also, what's with all the advertisements in these videos? That is a guy. Who's the guy that submits them? Can you not pronounce his name? Jordan. Sorry? Jordan. Jordan. Jordan, yeah. Yeah, that's not our advert. That's his advert, isn't it? Yeah. Advertises his shop. Yeah. So, there you go. But he's the only one that submits videos. He's the only one that submits videos. You're right, yeah. Kind of, apart from the other. Yeah. How many did he have in that one? Four? Uh, three. Three. Plus one year, so. Yeah. yeah. So, he's allowed to do that because he submits videos regularly. Yeah, every week. Every week, yeah. At least one. He puts the effort in. There you go. So we've got 227, 230, 230. Here we go. We've got them coming in now. 223. Keep voting away. Keep voting away. And then we can get to the amazing news that Mario's built up. Is this a new section, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Okay. Who's winning at the moment? We got a 223, 230, 230, 227, 227, 227. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Mm. Sorry? We need three, three people. Need three people. Is that it? Ends it. Yeah. Done. Excellent. Good stuff. Right. Go for the old news, shall we? The old news segment. Yeah. Extra, extra, extra. Read all about it. Boom! EUC cutout speed tester in Speedy Feet News. Ray Ronke, Ray Rockney made an interesting contraption that can help people test real cutout speed on EUCs without breaking any bones. Let's have a little look at the video. Okay, here's my contraption. Basically, these are rollers. I made a mistake. I got 10 inch rollers versus 16. I should have got 16 inch rollers would have made it easier. I haven't been able to keep it on these rollers at high speed. I think 20 something was the highest, but just now I did it at 37.1 when it cut out, but I forgot not to turn the wheel off. I, because if you turn the wheel off, then you lose the video. Okay. See, the problem is that. Right. Here we go. Boom, so that's that video. Now look at it, Ray says, in order to compensate for no wind resistance or friction, people can just take 10% the final result. What do you think about his contraption? John Logan, it's on mine, Logan, Logan, it's on mine. Bre checking in, bring in the good weather, he says. Excellent, slight diversion there from the old news. <laughs> Um, so yeah, that was quite a good video to show you what could possibly go wrong as Rich also says yeah. What could possibly go wrong? Probably not a lot to be honest no. <laughs> So good though. It's good someone trying to find some unique way of trying to get a top speed reading Whilst you're applying weight rather than just doing a lift test. So it kind of meets it part way I don't know what the rolling resistors of those rollers are like either Because presumably it's a form of resistance, but not as much resistance as tarmac Don't know Get Mario go away and do the science on that. Yep. 
Um, oh, here we go. Electric scooter riders as safe as cyclists on the road. And drivers, the dangers. Danger, says new report. A new report from the International Transport Forum, ITF, most of you know what ITF is, says that concerns surrounding the safety of e-scooters have been overemphasized and that people are not at significantly higher risk of death or injury when riding them than they are on a bicycle. Pointing out that motor vehicles are involved in four out of five fatal road collisions in which an e-scooter rider or cyclist is killed. The report says that encouraging more people to switch from cars to micro-mobility vehicles or bikes will actually improve road safety. Published recently, the Safe Micromobility Report from the ITF, which is a body of the Organisation for Economic Cooperation and Development, but operates independently of it, urges governments to draw up future-proof safety regulations regarding micromobility vehicles, given the pace at which they are developing. Not evolving. Developing, let's see. A Baltimore Harbour Tea Party. Last week, we showed you the clip where Landy from the Gladiators lost his Nicola Plus to the Baltimore Harbour. Have we still got that video? Saved out. Yeah. Is it there? Yeah, so. Oh, we're going to have a quick little check now. Just go into the control room. Just making sure we've got the footage. Yep. Yes, we do. Report back. We have. Yes, now playing the footage of that incident. Now live on air. Smooth as butter, Mario. Now we bring you the resolution of the story. Glidator's GoFundMe campaign managed to raise about $400 and with the discount from AMP Collective, very soon he will be getting a new Nicola Plus to get back into riding. A story with a happy ending. Ho oh, ho! Excellent. Crazy Russians. This is written by Mario, so... The next video comes from Phantomus and his friend Andre Wanted to know how fast does the M Super Pro go? The next video comes from Phantoms and his friend Andrea. Andre wanted to know how. I think, yeah, they. They wanted to know how fast does the M Super Pro go? Z. Go. Z. Just for reference, Phantomus weighs 65 kilograms or just under 10 and a half stone. Because in the UK, we like stones out of a stream, we use those to weigh people. On his first run, he got 69 kilometers an hour, or just under 43 miles per hour, but that wasn't enough for him. He wanted to push the wheel to the max and went out a second time. Here is the footage.
Wow. Okay, yeah. If you ever want an example of why not to go too fast, uh, there is an example of it, and how to injure yourself. Interesting. Uh, LiDAR scanning in Canada. Jackie Heishi posted this photo of himself on an electric unicycle with a mobile LiDAR scanning device on his back. LiDAR, sometimes called 3D laser scanning, is a surveying method that measures distance to a target by illuminating the target with laser light and measuring the reflected light with a sensor. The technology is used in some autonomous cars, but mainly it's for making high resolution maps with applications in forestry, mining, city planning, and etc. Riding your EUC whilst you're getting paid does seem like a dream come true. I, oh, that picture's gone. I haven't seen the picture yet. Let's see the picture. Let's see it. Look at him. He loves it. So he's riding a Tesla there. Gotway Tesla. That is sweet, isn't it? Bombing around with that bad boy in your back. Excellent. Very good. Next up, <clears throat> this is a video of electric skateboard versus a water pump pipe. Who do you think would win? Electric skateboard or pipe? You're about to find out. Wow, okay, that's another reason not to go fast because uh, of things like that. So you can see here there's a, a sort of a, a bit of a thing going on, a bit of a theme going on. And I should imagine, I'm not sure how he came out of that. I really hope he wasn't seriously injured because that looks really bad. Um, have you heard the engine revving on the new M Super Pro? And we've got a little video to show you. This is the brand new M Super Pro. <laughs> If you want to annoy everybody, you can also get an app and it's called Rev Heads and it's on the App Store if you wish to annoy everybody as well. We did it today. Uh, we annoyed everybody and we got how many people out of their offices? Quite a few. A couple. Yeah. Uh, come out and see what on earth is going on. Why such racket and why are you being so obnoxious? And that is, I believe, the end of the news. There we are. Good stuff. Right, let's scroll back up and check out the old uh, comments. NYC EUC, hi Chris from New York City. <clears throat> he has Monster V3, it probably should be easier to list the wheels he doesn't have. But anyway, Monster V3, Tesla V2, KS18 XL, KS16 X, KS6, KS14D, the Z10, the MSX 100 volt, and new to the lineup on Saturday, just got a Nikola 100 volt with 2,100, 700 cells. I ride the monster most. Welcome to the show. Bonez 1999 is in the market for a wheel. Brand new rider, never ever been on one of these things. What should I get? Not super expensive, but good quality for the dollar and good for beginners. Well, if you can get a good nine bottle one and someone's recommending a nine to one starter mo wheel, something really cheap, get something really, really cheap to start out with. Smash that up and then get yourself a good wheel. Uh, Rich says, get yourself cheap second-hand first wheel, something like a 9 one e Plus. Once you've mastered your skills and battered the wheel, you'll be able to treat yourself to a nice Gotway or King Song. Exactly right. Um, Dev Devastator EC, it's happened to me, I jump in the water quick, presumably in reference to losing the wheel. Mm -hmm. So uh, Ben Sims, that's my riding group. I missed the ride, but Landy, the guy who lost his wheel, got a new MSX due to a GoFundMe folks ran. Where was it? Which country? US, probably. Yeah, US, yeah. Um, uh, MS Pro, I know how fast it goes. It goes as fast as you can run out at. Exactly right, Rich. So on the leaflets we hand out with the wheels, which are up there, I'm not sure if they're in shot. They are in shot. There. Actually says there, only go a speed that you can run out of, unless you want serious injury. 
And you've got to remember that it's also serious injury to other people as well. That's part of the problem. If you go flat out and come off, the wheel could potentially stay upright and carry on going at that speed that you were going at. Um, or just go off anyway at slow speed and slam into someone. So there we go. Um, James Mucklin just gets up like it's nothing. Exactly right. But they were wearing full armour, weren't they? And Mario was on about that their wheels were actually covered in some sort of armour as well. Is that right? Yeah. There you go. Look. Bad conditions for 25 miles per hour. Never mind what that was. Yeah, so well, I mean, how fast was it? It was 42. Four, yeah, 42, 43 miles yeah. an hour, wasn't it? 43 miles an hour. There we go, 43 miles an hour. Um, but there we go. Don't go 43 miles an hour, because that's just mental. And uh, someone will get injured. Probably yourself, but sadly, it could be someone else. Have you got the video, by any chance, of you on the VAF? Yeah. Is it on there, is it? Yeah. Is it? Did you know it was going to be played today? Which one is it? The last one. Oh, the one today? Yeah. Yeah, play that then. It's like a sneaky peek, isn't it? Because yeah. VAF, we've been riding it. And it's uh, quite a... Well, we'll watch the video first. There we go. There you go, there's VAF, that's Mario on it. Just a sneak peek. Uh, I've had a go on it. I've blatted it around the um, warehouse. So all around the corridors. And I think they're onto a bit of a winner there. Very lightweight, but very powerful wheel. So nice and small and compact. The new side leg support pads are massively better than the other ones. Um, yeah, something about it is quite nice, if I'm honest. Uh, but full video up and coming, so. You will see. Let's just check the old Facebook. Uh, I don't think anyone's commented on there that I haven't responded to already. No, I think I've responded to everyone. Yeah, Daniel Torloff responded to him, definitely. There we go. So, uh, Santa Perry says smashing. I presume that's in reference to the crash in Russia. Did you notice as well it was snowing? So, well, there was snow yeah. on the ground. What better time to do a speed test when it's snowing? Can you think of a better time? I can't. Yeah, wait. Wet surface. So wet surface, possibly icy, really cold, so the batteries don't perform as well as they would do in warm weather. Um, and night time. Mm. All those things combined, along if you combine that with speed, very good. Not really, um, but there we go. So um, there we go, brilliant. Well, if you haven't already, don't forget to like this video and share the content. Check out our YouTube channel. And also go follow follow Instagram, where we've got some people following it. One thousand and ninety six people. Seventy six. Seventy six. You're going seventy six. Yeah. Let's find out if Mario's doing his thing. Is it seventy six? Let's find out. One thousand and ninety five. Oh. So I was one out. You were something out. There we go. Uh, so worth going follow there, behind the scenes footage, you would have seen the VAF video if you're following us on Instagram. Our handle Mario is... In the, in Brilliant, the can never remember it. Speedy underscore feet okay. is what it is. So go to Instagram at speedy underscore feet and then you can go and follow along all our videos and behind the scenes stuff and things like that. And join in the conversation. Obviously go to our Facebook page, like that. Um, and most of all, go to speedyfeet.co.uk and check out our wheels and products that we've got there. Flies are coming back. Annoying flies. Um, so until next week, we'll be back next week. Uh, hopefully some more videos re sort of released. There's definitely the VAF should be coming out at some point. M103. Um, yeah, pretty much. And uh, we will see you next week. Thank you very much for tuning in. Have a good week all and stay safe. Don't ride like the Russians in that video. Ride sensibly and a speed that you can run out of. And you should be all right. So... Uh, yeah. Thank you very much. And see you next time.